Morrowind is not as great of an RPG as Daggerfall is and was. It seems to me a lot was promised, and very, very little of that was delivered. Anyone who remembers the early days of Quake 1 and the final release version probably got deja vu when playing Morrowind for a while. Okay, that's the simple of it. Now let me get into the details. If you've played Daggerfall before, then I'm sure you're looking at the same things I am. Where are the lycanthropes? Where are the horses and carts? Where's the ability to buy houses and ships? 24 hour shops? Any city to any city travel? Non icon based inventory system? The people of Morrowind too poor for banks? To be brutal, Morrowind is a lot closer to an adventure game or an MMORG than a true hard bred PC RPG. Take away the pretty eye candy and what do you have? If you replace the graphical blubber, and it is blubber, an incredibly terrible graphical engine, take a look at something like Tribes 1 and its incredibly poor visual to performance trade-off with a system comparable or identical to what Daggerfall had, and it just doesn't stand up at all. Sure, who doesn't enjoy pleasing graphics? But it gets fairly dull when you're going through your upteenth sandstorm and looking at yet another nice looking, but still the same, night sky. More and more as I play, it seems Morrowind is somehow incomplete. Was it close to being canceled altogether? And did Nvidia graciously donate a certain sum of money with the understanding that the graphics engine for the game would push more people to purchase their higher and newer end cards? Support is offered for ATI cards also, but it seems incredibly silly to me to listen to so-called RPG fans gush over water and what they can do to fine tune their displays. Is this what we have to look forward to in the future? Affirmed RPG fans more concerned with graphical eye candy rather than hard and solid content, which Morrowind is sorely lacking in my O. I suppose that you could say in my case, the editor provided with Morrowind would be this game saving grace. And while it does seem very powerful, it would require a lot or work on my part as I have zero interest in a setting that looks remotely like the boring crud that is Tamriel, and I would have to change everything. I'm starting to ask myself whether or not I want to make an RPG that moves so sluggishly and poorly with hardly anything on screen. I would want a lot more stuff on screen than what Morrowind has. I don't know. Maybe in the future when computers and vid cards are more powerful? Right now, I don't think I'd take a chance with it. Maybe Neverwinter Nights will be better. <sighs> You're right. As it stands, I can honestly say I enjoy Dungeon Siege, a friggin' MRPG, more than I enjoy playing Morrowind. I can't say it's a big letdown, however, as I never had high expectations to begin with. I still see so much damn wasted potential, though. So much that could have been done and wasn't, probably because of time and budget constraints with the graphics engine. Overall, Morrowind is not a worthy successor in Daggerfall. It falls short in a lot of role-playing areas and suffers from the same problems that other graphics-intensive RPGs suffer. If this is the state of the art for the PC RPGs, then I think it's time I dug around for Legacy of the Ancients or Questron 2.